Heartbreaking story out of Southwest Houston. This precious two-year-old girl killed in an apartment fire. It happened this afternoon at the complex near Corporate at Westwood Place Drive. Investigators still there right now. Channel 2's Sophia Beausoleil is there with them and joins us live. Sophia? Well, Bill, investigators actually just left moments ago, but they've been out here all day trying to figure out what exactly caused this fire that started around 2 o'clock this afternoon. It was a three-alarm fire, destroyed 12 units, and you can see right now people are actually in their apartments using flashlights to see what is left and what they can salvage because obviously the power is still out. But tonight, neighbors, along with that little girl's family, are trying to cope with what happened today. It's a situation that would leave anyone speechless. Della Medina lost her home Monday afternoon, but what's hurting her most is that her neighbor's daughter was trapped inside the burning building. I was watching TV and then uh, I heard the lady screaming for her daughter. The cell phone video shows the roaring flames and intensity of an apartment fire, which claimed the life of two and a half year old Giselle Eileen Gomez. Another guy that lives around here, he was trying to go in and, and get the little girl out, but he couldn't see nothing in there. It was just too late. Relatives of the toddlers say her mother and five year old brother were inside the apartment when the fire happened. They believe a TV set in the room Giselle was playing in caught on fire. The smoke was so strong, the mom couldn't get to her daughter. The wind started blowing and then it just like really Quick, went to the bottom and then the window shattered and then another big boom. Della and her husband, like a dozen others, are now without a home. And for this family, they'll never get the chance to see a young girl grow up. Now, ultimately, it's up to the fire marshal to determine what exactly caused this fire. But as soon as we find out, we will let you know. We also spoke with the little girl's mother. As you can imagine, she was just absolutely distraught. Reporting live from Southwest Houston, Sophia Bosley, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Just unimaginable, Sophia.